at a certain point, you're going to want to work some texture back into there. Call up another layer and get that um, sharp chalk. Call up that lava I was looking at earlier. Since this is kind of a decrepit, messed up scenario, I'm just going to use that. And, you know, real light, but um, get it in there. Dab it in there. It'll it'll help add some detail without actually having to go in and noodle it. And then, like you know, you can erase uh, back out with your scratchboard eraser. Drawing. Okay. Okay. Let's rim light this ship. New layer. Select the color, the local color of the, of the um, helicopter, and go to a lighter. You, know, you call up another layer, and it's rim lit. So you're just gonna start to, you know, rim light it. Paint paint a lighter rim on the uh, on all the surfaces. And you can be messy because it's on a layer, and you can come back in and erase out, right? where it stops. So that's cleaning it up and that's giving you that look already. Um, using the scratchboard tool at a very low opacity, I I just, I really like the look of it. It, it looks kind of markery, gouache, sketchy when you use it at a very low opacity. It's kind of cool. You can erase back out. So this is kind of a noodly phase where, where I had that earlier phase where I was using the line, remember the line work to, to kind of define the, 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 the design phase? This is kind of the noodly where you're going to render it phase, you know? And that's what you're doing. You're just, that low opacity uh, scratchboard tool, you're going to go in and, you know, when you're doing an illustration, you, you're painting light, you know? That's the way I started out my other DVDs, which were... Um, you know, all about this kind of start with the lights off and then turn the lights on thing. And, um, you know, you can see I haven't really changed that much when, when I'm doing these, these quick sketch renderings.